Thank you, Emma. Tonight, Tulsa is joining an exclusive club as a certified welcoming city. Tulsa is the 21st in the nation and the first in the state. This morning, leaders from Welcoming America, it's an Atlanta-based organization, presented Mayor D.T. Bynum with a certificate. 2 News Oklahoma's Brody Myers brings us the story. When Nam Loon immigrated to Tulsa at the age of 15, she didn't understand why her parents chose this town. Because Tulsa is not a city that you see on a movie. <laughs> it's not, you know, like LA or Florida or, you know, Miami or New York. Loon said her dad always aspired toward the American dream. Tulsa was picked for its Zomi population. The Loons are Zo people who come from Myanmar. Welcoming America says they are a nonprofit, nonpartisan organization that leads a movement of inclusive communities becoming more prosperous by ensuring everyone belongs. Regional Manager Jordan Crumroy presented Mayor G.T. Bynum with Tulsa's Welcoming City Certificate. You know, cities are really at the front lines of welcoming. Cities feel demographic change. They feel the effects of the economy. Uh, they really see it firsthand. Tulsa joins places like Dallas, Louisville, and Salt Lake City in this designation, all considered Republican cities. But as Mayor Bynum says, this transcends politics. I would ask my fellow Tulsans to think about the kind of city that you would want your ancestors to have come to. That's the kind of city that we want Tulsa to be for immigrants who are coming to our city today. The Loons immigrated to Tulsa during the recession. That posed obvious financial challenges on top of the family's language barrier. So I have to like go to you know doctor's appointment with them or just go with them everywhere as their personal interpreter. The decision makers at Welcoming America expect cities to have an environment of inclusivity, which naturally includes efforts to remove language barriers. Challenges like that frustrated a young loon, but she's proud of the wisdom it brought her. Well, the older I get and the more I'm here, I'm glad that we moved to Tulsa. In Tulsa, Brody Myers, 2 News, Oklahoma. Welcome America has seven frameworks for welcoming cities, and we listed them in this story on our 2 News app.